Princess Leonor is on her second year of military training. The next in line to the Spanish throne started her military journey with army training in Zaragoza last year. Late August of 2024, she joined other trainees in the Naval Academy in Porto Verde. She has been resilient through it all and with the extra responsibilities that she has, she managed to multitask them to a successful completion. She attained the age of majority last year in September and took her oath in Parliament at the same time. Although the Spanish royal family has been facing a decline in popularity amongst the public, the 19-year-old has managed to single-handedly better the numbers in favor of the royal family. With barely two years in the military schools she has attended, the fans, both local and international have been following every piece of update about the heiress. She has been a source of most sought after royal news in the same vein. The Times, an international publication while writing about her, dubbed her the Top Gun Princess. Pictures of the princess shared by the royal family on their social media pages have gone viral, especially the one she is in uniform. Her having gone through the same routine at the training school as well as eating food similar to all other cadets has endeared her to the public. With reports out that she is not getting the same treatment that made her popularity shoot right up. When she completes her second year at the naval school, she is said to be headed to the Air Force Academy towards the end of next year. She will be trained about flying planes and fighter jets, people can't wait for that as the top gun princess will be able to prove just how to do it. Her hard work and humility have been evident in all the field and outdoor exercises, she has done well and not been a burden to her classmates. Her first bout of popularity was obvious when she turned 18 last year, she was raved about by the international fans and Spaniards. The media called it the Leonor Mania craze and she influenced a lot of young people, something she has kept up with. Apparently, her with the princess signing up for military training, more women have picked up and their numbers are up compared to the years prior. She is the new face of the Spanish royalty and with her commitment to the Spanish flag as well as her king, she has attracted a fervent feeling of pride and love of country. As she advances in her training both military and education, she has cemented her name in the most influential royals across the globe. The princess still has to train as well as undertake her other royal duties and she has done so dutifully. Putting her best foot forward and without scandals, the firstborn daughter of King Felipe will make a great queen for Spain someday in the future.